to say? Whatever, everybody. Wait, hold on. Do I look okay? My most embarrassing moment is super embarrassing. Um, so I like this girl named Kaylee Cuesta. A lot of you guys probably aren't fans. Um, so we were at a pool party, and I thought I was being so cool because I was like hanging out on the water slide and like just sitting there, and like I sat there a long time, and like you know how the water slides are kind of rough, like the surfaces, and I sat there like a long time, and I, when I got up. I walked inside and apparently my pants had ripped and everybody was laughing at me and I had no idea what was going on until like someone told me, hey bro, everyone just like, but <laughs> well, I have developed a lot of pet peeves over this past two months, but I would say my biggest one. And this is going to surprise a lot of you because a lot of you guys do this and I say nothing about it. But do not ever call me bud or buddy. I I literally want to die when someone calls me bud or buddy. Well, I shouldn't say that. But <laughs> honestly, like, it is the most demeaning thing and it makes me feel like I'm five years old and just, like, peed in my pants in the schoolyard. Like, I really, really don't like it. So that's my biggest pet peeve. Okay, first of all, that tickled so much. <laughs> Second of all, I did not hear what you said. Just say it to the camera. Yeah, no, put, I can't. I'm no, sweating. It's so embarrassing, huh? No, it's not embarrassing. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> no, it's not funny. It's not Kayla. funny. <laughs> I can see. Aww. Can I take it off a little? Take it off. It's okay. It's from my makeup. It doesn't stick. You're not lying hard anymore. Ooh. I said, <laughs> I just burped and I, 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 didn't, I, I can't hear what you said because I burped. I said, turn off the camera or something. Well, I have this really, really crazy dream of me and all my friends. And like, I know my friends aren't down for this yet. Yes, we are. And like, no, you're not. I promise well, maybe you are. I maybe mean, you are. But I've been, like, like, I think, like, everybody gets their glimpse of hell in life. And everybody goes through things that they think they can't endure. But it is durable. And um, and this has kind of been that event for me. And I think my glimpse of hell has been, like, a little bit stronger than most of you guys's. And, like, I hope that, like, that's not bragging. Like, I promise you don't want this. Um, But... Because of it, I've I've I really like I've just developed such a passion for sharing the gospel, like it's so strong. And I have this dream to not go to college, and for me and my friends to walk around the world and share the gospel with everyone we see. And I understand it's a little bit drastic, but like I, I think that would be so awesome. What's your favorite Bible verse? And why? Um, you can take this one. Okay, thank you, Erica. Yeah. Um, my favorite Bible verse is Exodus thirteen and fifteen, and um, it's the Lord is a warrior. The Lord is His name, and it's a it's kind of a simple verse and kind of a lot of a verse that a lot of people would skip over. And obviously, it's highly applicable to me right now. But um, I, the reason why I like that verse is because. Um, the warrior aspect of Christianity is something that we miss so many times. And I feel like nowadays, like, you look around and, like, all we have is a bunch of nice church churchgoers. And that honestly does the kingdom of God nothing. That brings God um, almost nothing. Like, God God designed us to be, like, powerful and, and warriors. And I think so many times we miss that. You guys took, like, 30 minutes. Let's say vote for us at the same time. So, oh, wait, one. wait, no, that, no, one, say, God bless you, or Jesus Christ loves you. Okay. One, two, Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ loves, loves you. you.